Hello everybody, Crystal Katsuna here, and we are coming back to where in the USA is Carmen San Diego, um, where, where we less, left, left, blah, 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 where we last left off, um, we had six cases that we needed to do in order to get the next promotion. So, Here's off what camera, we know I went so ahead far. and I did just that. I did up to To four start cases. your investigation, call and Acme Travel Service. We, or Over not we, now. but I did four cases off camera so that way we didn't have to sit here and. To start um, your investigation, phone Acme Travel Service. Okay, now shut up. Jesus. So I did four cases off camera, so you don't have to worry about um, doing multiple cases and then having to sit there and watch them. Out of my, out of the curi curious, curious, kindness out of my heart. I don't know why I said so curious. Uh, the kindness of my heart to keep you from being bored. Uh, I went ahead and did the four cases, so we have two cases before the promotion. So, yay! Then we get to do that. Um, so. We just jumped right into it because if you don't, then the the um, logo, logo and the intro thing comes in, and that's kind of loud and annoying. So we're just gonna jump right into it. <coughs> also, when I was playing this this uh, game earlier today to uh, to get those four cases, every at a certain point there was like on the box down here, it, you know, when you call CrimeNet. It gives you text there in the black box. Well, I was reading it and it like kind of like did weird like text jargon, you know, like computer jargon. Like it was like that's what they were supposed to put in like code. It was like kind of like code. It was weird. Okay, so he was working on a southern draw, repeating over and over, making Columbus Augusta. Georgia, duh. <coughs> I asked him to sit a spell and offered him some one calorie lemonade. Okay, so he is he, and his food is dietetic. Diet, dietetic. Okay, we're just gonna search the opera house. Um, Augusta, Maine. Maybe I got the wrong one. Let's see what crime that says. The going underground. Suspect Macon. Oh, it's not Macon was in Georgia though. <coughs> well, we'll see. Yeah, Georgia. We shall see. That's the only one that looks remotely right. Because Atlanta. Yeah, we got it right. So, also, I told you in a previous video, a couple of videos, that I was going to do my hair pink. You can't really tell the pinkness. I mean, it looks, like, darker in this camera. You can't really tell that it's pink um, in this lighting. But that's what it came out to. I figured that it probably wouldn't do it like it was on the box. I figured it would probably make it look like it was strawberry blonde or something. Um, in yellow light, it looks kind of orangish. And and looks like it's like strawberry blonde, but I think if you like had it in like direct white light or something, it wouldn't look like that. But there's a picture of this on Twitter. Uh, I took it when I was in the bathroom uh, in front of the mirror, and uh, but that's the result of me doing pink. Um, it didn't come out that bad. I think it's be mainly because um, my hair has like kind of golden orange tones to it because I'm normally brown haired so it's it kind of takes that um, even when I dye my hair blonde it has like a golden tint to it so anything that's gonna be pink is gonna end up kind of like an orangish color so since we got this we'll go ahead and see what the clues are uh, he got a call from a friend named Sue in Suitsi Marie Salt Beware of someone with coffee colored lit up coffee colored eyes. Enunciate yourself. Hmm. Do not hear eyes. Derp. Okay, there we go. 
I am like tripping over myself so bad today. I mean, like, I just tried to record just a second ago this whole episode, and like the first five minutes was just me, like, like I was trying to think of what to say while I was trying to move things around and, and adjust them, which I shouldn't do on camera, but I was trying to get things to where I can see that and then that at the same time. But anyway, uh, Saginaw Bay. That should be Michigan. Saginaw, Michigan. I grew up listening to country songs, so I should know. <sighs> yeah, Michigan. That's up in the Great Lakes. So we go to Michigan. Michigan. Detroit, Michigan. So in one episode, when I was talking about where was your best vacation at, and I had one friend reply, uh, that their best uh, vacation was in uh, when they went to Hawaii. <clears throat> um, I think this time the question I'm not, I don't do questions all the time because you know a lot of people don't leave comments or whatever. But just for shits and giggles, if you could go anywhere, either in the United States or even uh, internationally, where would you want to go? Um, if I had to go somewhere in state, I would like to check out. Hawaii, because a lot of people go there as a tourist trap, but I, I still want to see what it's like. Um, for a non-tourist trap, well, all places are basically tourist traps that are interesting. Um, but for international, I would like to go to Japan. Um, he had a mammoth plan to steal all the stalactites in Mammoth Cave National Park. So somewhere where it's cold a lot, like Colorado or Alaska. Uh, <clears throat> he loved all of Mozart's sym symphonies, so music is classical, so we'll transmit that and see if we get a warrant. Warrant division, Wanda, Wanda here. Wanda here. Here's your warrant. Awesome. For etc. I just love how weird these names are. Etc. Hal EU Hallelujah. <clears throat> Drawing off the rope between Green Pass, Parkway, between Lexington and Elizabethton. Lexington. That's somewhere in the south, I think. Suspects seen hoarding hordes of d'oeuvres between Lexington, mm -hmm, Lexington and Frankfurt. So I think it's Kentucky? Because the horse center of America, that would be Kentucky, right? Yeah, Louisville. Kentucky. <laughs> and we were back. The only thing, though, about this game is like the, the animations. Like the, the, when you go from city to city, then they give you the animation of whether you got the location right or whatever. I don't like the fact that they're like not that many of them. I mean, it's a it's a game that came out in the 90s. You can't really expect a lot, but I would kind of like st like to see like different ones. I mean, in the later years when they did Where in the World or Where in the World and Where in the USA is coming to San Diego, I think I've only seen like a up more updated version of Where in the World, but they have like instead of going from town to town like this and you just ask people off of a list, like you pan either left or right and there's people there. And you have to question them, and they get, and you get like four people or five people or whatever to give you clues. And it's like much harder, at least for me at the time, to pick out the people who are the dolphins. Because you actually have to pick out the criminal from like a, a people. Like you look at your clues and everything like that, and you go, okay, so this guy has red hair and blue eyes and da da da. da. And when you go to the place that has the the bad guy, you have to scroll through all the people in that particular town and then pick out the one that doesn't automatically do it for you. So it gets a little bit harder, you know, in later years, but it was like later 90s, like 95, 96, 97, 98 maybe, I don't know when the actual other one came out, but it was a while ago. Um, he had a lot of moxie and was headed to Biloxi to run around in the seaside playground. So look for something that was that's coastal. So either east coast or west coast. Um, gain of thieves slip into the 20th state without a trace. The only mistake was showing up the, on the Natchez Trace Parkway. 
think so. I'm thinking it's somewhere in New England. Such as suspect stole a boat boat from Gulfport and took it to the Gulf Islands National Seashore. So I'm thinking it's on the east coast, somewhere in one of the north or uh, new um new Newark, I guess, is the only one that's that f close to the water. Sometimes you can do process of elimination. Even if you don't, like, know the cities that are in that particular state, you can kind of, like, guess by, um... Oh, no, it's not right. Okay, then... Forget what I said. Um... Then it has to be Washington? Because that's the only other one that's near, like, the ocean. I was thinking it was the, the, the East Coast, because he said something about ports and 20th state or whatever. No? Huh? Okay, we're gonna probably fuck this one up, because I have no idea. Okay, Indianapolis, Desmond, Jackson. No, that's not where we're at, right? That's the only one that's a coast. We're probably not going to get the dossier or, or person in this one. There we go. Mississippi. I was like, oh my god. It's like, okay, so that's the east coast. It's not the west coast. So, coast is the left. The uh, south coast. Not the English thing, but the south. But it takes time to go from place to place. So, and you only have to like a certain amount of time to, to get your criminal. So if you fuck around and get the wrong place, then you're pretty much SOL. <clears throat> he said he planned to climb Black Mesa in the panhandle between Colorado, New Mexico, and Texas. So that's Idaho. The panhandle is Idaho, I think. Two gallons of still water, Dunkin' Donuts, packets of Cimarron Raisin Bread, cinnamon, I think it's supposed to be cinnamon. Cimarron, whatever. And one rasher of Canadian River Bacon. That doesn't tell me anything. I think it's Idaho. Because Idaho is the big handle, I think. Suspect standing under mistletoe is even in December. Again, that doesn't give me any clues. Where is the Idaho? The thing what I was saying, though, was sometimes you can read the clues about, like, the location. Because if you read, it says sea, port, Etc. Etc. Then you can like pretty much guess that it's somewhere. Okay, so that's not the panhandle. What the frig? I'm like doing really bad on this today. Um. Okay, this is the panhandle then. <clears throat> They're both shaped the same. Jesus. But I'm like reading through, and I'm like there. Uh, I'm like reading the clues, and the clues like give you this thing that says port. Mountains, blah, da, da, da. so when you re if you don't know the, the state by the names of the cities, then you can kind of guess. So when you go to Acme Travel and then you look at the different states that you have to choose from, then you like try to pick the one that fits the location. So if it says port, you look for one that's either near a river or not a river, but near a lake or near open ocean. If it's like mountains, it's usually almost always Colorado or like a Montana or something like that. So, reporter. Okay, so we got our thing. So, we should be able to catch him. Now, when I was doing this before, there was like a lot of times when the dossier, like you read the dossiers of the criminals, and there's two of them that have very close credentials. Like, they like the same thing except for their hair color is different. It's Hallelujah and, um, I forgot what the other guy's name was. But everything except for, like, their hair color. They like vegetarian food, or they're vegetarian. They like salsa music. They're brown, uh, have brown eyes or something like that. So their credentials are almost exactly the same. Except for, like I said, their hair color is different. So, because when I was doing the four episodes, or the four things beforehand, it was like, okay, well, you have two options here, so you have to find another clue. So I had to find a third, or a fifth clue to 
separate the two. So, but there's times that you'll Order get like a court. warrant. Or, I mean, I'm too good for Gordon it now, but when I was younger and I was doing this, guilty. you'll get a warrant for the wrong person, and then they're like, sorry, we can't apprehend this person, or, or we can apprehend them, but we can't arrest them because you have the wrong warrant. I had that happen to me hey, like a couple of times nice when work. I was younger. So we need to crack through okay, the other case you really fast, because case? we're like at 14 minutes. Or actually, almost 15 minutes. So we need to get crackalacking so we, we can. I don't know why I said crackalacking. That's a really dumb word. Um, we need to get cracking so we can get through and to have start a good your time. Investigation. Phone Acme Travel Service. Now get going. So we have from Wednesday to, to Wednesday at 9 p.m. So we have like a week, basically. the case. And if you don't do it within a week, then time's up. I don't know if I'm going to spray. Which I've had happen before, too. Because I was really bad with states and capitals and cities and things like that. So any time that I would try to do this uh, game when I was younger, I had to cheat. And by trying to doing it by myself, I'd read through the thing and I'm like, oh, it's this state. And then it's like, nope. And then I forget which state I was at before, and I forget which ones were there before when I did the wrong state. So that was like jumping all over the place and taking up too much time, and never did get the dossier. Or the, I, I keep saying dossier, but the dossier is their credentials, not their actual thing. So you actually are catching a criminal, and the dossier is their their likes and dislikes and all that crap. Okay, so if you're driving, she said. So it's a girl, female. If you're driving up the coast from Baltimore New to New York, and you accidentally sneeze, you miss the state altogether. So it's like one of those little small states, like New Hampshire or something. Okay, so search station. First state ratifies constitution. Okay, let's go to Herbert Heberg and get... My nickname for her is Goldilocks. Goldilocks. Which means she's got blonde hair like what I used to have until I turned it pink. <laughs> that was a really bad, like, southern accent. And I have no offense to anybody who's southern that talks sort of like that. Um, Rhode Island, Colorado, Delaware. So it has to be Rhode Island. Because that's the only one that's up there that is up there. Besides New York. Although it could have been Willingmonton. Hello? Okay. The game just froze. Um. Okay. I never had that happen before. The whole game froze. Well, we might have to leave, um, the second episode, or the second case, till next time. Um. Because this game is froze. I mean, the the I never had this happen before, and I don't know why all of a sudden it's freezing. But it's not playing anymore. It usually just would turn over the page and tell me where I'm at next, and it's not doing anything. And I can't click any other buttons. Okay, well that's amazing. That never happened to me before on this game. So I guess that's gonna be it for this game. Um, sadly, we didn't get to finish uh, this case uh, and find out uh, what our next promotion is. So, sadly, we'll have to do that in epi the next episode, which I think it's a, we're on episode 5, I think. So it'll be in episode 6. But we'll definitely get the promotion next time. Um, but for some reason, this is crashed. Or it's not crashed, but it's just frozen. And I can't do anything to fix it. Um, so, uh, hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, go ahead and give it a like. And share with your friends. Word of mouth helps out a lot. Um, be sure to see what that red button does below me. And do what it says if you want. I'm not twisting your arm. Um, be sure to follow me on Twitter so you can see my hair. Uh, I actually posted a picture of me with the color in my hair um, and then posted the result 
which is this. It looks a lot better on there than it does in, in here. Um, also, if you want to get merchandise, there's a pay, uh, link to all that stuff in the, in the description, but you can also get from the splash page, or the splash page, from the front page of my channel, all the little icons there you can click on. There's Spreadshirt, there's uh, Tumblr and, and um, Instagram and Twitter. You can click on all of those and add me, um, which would be great. Uh, I do mostly Twitter, so if you if you want to, you know, get stuff off of Twitter, then or get stuff from me outside of, of YouTube, Twitter would be the place to go because I don't really keep upkeep with the Tumblr, don't really upkeep with the Instagram. So, with the, without further ado, uh, sorry this didn't pan out or this, you know, screwed up, but we will get back to it and hopefully it will work next time. And I'll see everybody next time. Bye!